You're listening to the Doug Stanhope Podcast. We're on record. No, this is a bonus Patreon. Well, as long as you're making the rules. <laughs> well, Patreon deserves as many off the record podcasts as they've given a dollar or more a month. I thought you were completely joking. Who are you talking to? You. I'm talking to you. You who has made my life perfect that I couldn't live without. Even high and above Brian Hennigan. Who? Who? Yeah, I, th- I think he phones it in. You just threw a chair over and smashed a window. Well, you didn't really smash a window, but it not, seemed not, like it. Not, and I thought you were record, kidding. For the neither of those things happened. It see, I thought you were kidding, I and you were coming that. right back. What? Like, because we were just talking about the times that we walked you, because I give you shit. Yeah. And then you tried to walk me uh, yeah, to the extent that you walked me, and now you're wondering what? I thought you were kidding. This time. Other times, I like, oh, uh, yeah. We've rehearsed this seven times before Super Bowl. And now you're asking me if we rehearsed this. It's, I saw it's sad. Tracy. It's sad. I saw Tracy follow you into the dog shit yard. Where now it's a dog graveyard. <laughs> and Literally. I, and, and Chad said, I can go talk him out of this. Oh, Jesus. And now you're back with Chad. All right, so did I make you talk feel me bad? Out of what? Talk me out of what? I didn't say I could talk you. You threw out a man. fucking chair I know down. there's a lot of hyperbole on that because yeah. seriously, I, I told you, you would not go after me. I if, told you exactly what was said yeah. before we came up out, here, and you know, know that, Shaley. Tracy, what are you I'm saying? I'm a diplomat, so you don't you? Screen, you didn't knock the chair down. I, he no, threw I, a chair I, down on his way out. I flipped the Bingo chair. Bingo picked it up. I thought you knocked it down. No, no she picked it up. Bingo no. picked it up. I thought you knocked it Bingo down. does not want any part of the podcast except for picking up all the <laughs> fucking wreckage. Even when Doug says, hey, Bingo, do your part of the podcast, and she still doesn't want to do part of the podcast. No, and no. I, honestly, I didn't want to be any part of the podcast that was the focal point, and you kept pushing it towards there. I don't know why. I don't know why. You keep bringing it up. Uh, uh, that's up to the listener to, uh, <laughs> to, 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 to feed back who was at the fault. I actually got uh, both sides of the story while you were away. Where I might both have been sides of the story with me, you, you and who else? Dick. Both well, sides. Well, you were gone. He got your you side. You got my side, your side, and who else's side during both sides of the story? Well, oh, there's other people Tracy. here. Olivia Grace, who we've ignored the entire time. Who doesn't need, even know who BJ and the Bear are? I don't. <laughs> I don't. I don't okay, account for. Her. Is that the helicopter you were talking about earlier? Oh, you wish oh. it was just a helicopter. <laughs> that might have been four podcasts ago. <laughs> uh, Greg Chaley, I love you. I'm sorry, Olivia what? Grace I'm sorry, what? Had, had a uh, I love you. Olivia Grace and I had a long, drunken conversation about how you're the most important person in our lives, even when we think that you hate us and you flip over chairs. <laughs> Wait, who are you talking about? Who knows? I don't know. Hmm. Not Brian Hennigan. Can I get a drink? <laughs> <laughs> I really wish you wouldn't antagonize your guest after I brought him back up here. He's antagonized. This is how long it takes to get a bartender to come over to my end of the bar. I'm not mad. He's mad. Tracy Wernit or Wernot, only person who's never bothered me in my life. Never, 
ever once antagonized <laughs> me, irritated me. I can tell everyone in this room, Chad Shank, Olivia Grace, Greg Chaley. Clearly we know I've been bingo him. over there. Not yawning, thank you. Do you want to go back into the questions? I thought I, I think we answered done. them all in your absence you after you really? after you slammed up chairs. No, I need and, and I need to know window. who like the questions because we're sending. Yeah, we did we we did them all. No, you didn't. Oh, wait. How do you know what we did when you were away? We did everything because Chad's telling me. Yes, we're sending gifts to all the people who ask questions. Patreon. Yes. Patreon people. Anything on there? No, no, no. Oh, that's awesome. Bingo ones, went on mic and yeah, said, I apologize yeah. for I Greg like Chaley's Excellent. impertinence. Uh, was you know, th th there's no apologizing for me. Bingo did it. That's why she's leaving. Bingo. She's leaving right now. Oh. She went on and said, listen, oh, I, I'm sorry for Greg Chaley and his unprofessional. You're peeing. Do it in the toilet. The For urinal. once. Mm. All right. So why did we start this? If there's no Patreon questions, why did we start this podcast? We had one more podcast we had to do. We have a ton we have to do. What's this? This one could be about nothing. Well, this... Uh, is this a Seinfeld episode? Is yes. that what we're doing? <laughs> yeah, we're, 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 I think we're way too drunk to realize how many podcasts we've done in a day. Because well, at one point, remember when Chaley said break and he thought it was the end of the podcast, but it was the 20 minute mark? Common mistake. Well, not for Greg Chaley, who's on top of clearly, everything. Clearly, you're right. So uh, we are doing extra podcasts because uh, you are going to be getting ready for your tour, and I'm going to be up in Boise, Idaho, working with my brother, and then going to St. Louis for the show. This is like the fourth podcast. I think this will be already out by the time Hopefully, I've already done. I hope we have enough on the free podcast. We still have a fucking whole month of February to do more podcasts. Well... We'll see what happens. We do? <laughs> what the fuck are we doing this for? <laughs> I don't know. No, these are Patreon questions. Can I get a drink? Oh, God. That's too much. Oh, yeah. It's a little, yeah. I think there needs to be more vodka in these tomato heady things. So, Doug. Where's Bingo? I need Guzzle Monkey. Oh, shit. Wow. There he is. The he wing. looked all over for Meatwig, and he was nowhere. And now he comes in off the rails. That's beautiful. When, 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 when I wrote about fucking Meatwig, everyone misread it. Oh, R.I.P. Meatwig. I'll miss him fucking bothering the podcast with it. Now here he is. But, no. Doug, even you were, like, mourning him. Yeah, but when you I wrote he about was dead and and Egg Lester Tracy, <laughs> you called the vet to like get in because you said I'm going. I just need someone to come out and kill my cat. You know and they go, I'm Do you want to just bring him in for a check? No. I'm out. Oh. There he goes. I'm out. You, you can't break a screen twice. I said twice. <laughs> oh. See what happens? He did gently throw down a chair. Hey, what? <laughs> hey, uh, until I have to listen to it, what happened when I was gone? We read the rest of those questions. Oh, my God. The, the people who uh, submit Patreon questions, actually, you know, they, we sent them something. <laughs> and the paper you gave me had no marks on it. I had no idea. Oh. If they were, the last three on that other page yeah. seemed uh, uh, inflammatory and uh, <laughs> not uh, productive to our... Those were the end of the podcast. I wanted to end up on like a crazy, fiery note. Yeah. Chad, uh, are I you cut, kidding I cut me? those as producer. Oh, man. As stand-in producer, I Good cut job. those. Good job. From the podcast. 
They were horrible. I didn't like them. I actually the uh, the, the lead offs to our next series of questions. Yeah, those are my guys. Yeah. Yeah, you know, you even drew a no. big X through them. <laughs> well, because I want to save them for the next one. Saw my dog, uh, Meat Week. <laughs> Meat Week on my mind. See? Uh, I was waiting until you were looking before I threw the same I beer can. Flint you threw it. And you landed on the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> and the cat that loves you. That yeah. that doesn't that cat know be you tried dead. to kill it I for, prematurely. I, I, I forgot <laughs> Shannon threw a beer can at you till yeah. you threw that at him. That was I waited till he was looking. He ducked. I didn't do shit. I thought I was gonna pull this screen door shut. Uh, there's is no this a door. new podcast? I don't even know. You called it. It's not it's but, not uh, a good Is it one. the same podcast? I don't fucking know. Listen, listener out there, sometimes you uh, the fucking day drinking goes too long and you're with us so hopefully you're not listening to this in a car on your way to work <laughs> in a three-hour fucking yeah so this is a party that went on too long and uh i hope this is not a new podcast because it says it's we're like 11 minutes who in. knows so if that's who fucking chaley will fix it in to, post uh, We'll see. That's what he does. See, we'll, we'll see how it turns Other out. Other than walking out and slamming chairs, what Chaley does Tearing is makes everything door. work, not just on the podcast, at the house, building the fucking additions. He, Chaley does everything. So when he does walk out and slam chairs, it's hilarious to me. <laughs> That's pretty fun. He needs it. He needs that. He just needs it's, it. You don't know what I need. He needed to go down and eat a vegan If I burger. knew what you want, I'd be giving it to you. I can sing Bojangles. Wait, that's not, uh, the Bangles. Bojangles. <laughs> Bojangles. Or, <laughs> I'd be Bojangles. giving it to you. Walk like an Egyptian. Oh, well, I don't know. What, what are you talking about? But she don't know what she needs and the thing, that other thing. It's just another manic Monday. <laughs> yeah, Prince. Uh, no, that's oh, Prince wrote it. Prince wrote it. Yeah. yeah. Thank God he's dead. No. <laughs> he died in a helicopter. That wasn't accident. the Bojangle. No. Fuck. Listen, you kids listening to this podcast. You're welcome into our circle, but sometimes our circle is really fucked up. And we've been up too long and we've driven too far in our own fucking psyche. And yeah, so if you're on your way to work going, these guys are fucking wrecked, well, you're going to have to pause this podcast. And listen to it at 1130 at night while you're reconnoitering everything you've done wrong with your life. And uh, the baby's crying or whatever the fuck is going on. Yeah, you could have made different choices. But your different choice is joining us in the funhouse when we're just completely fucked after days of... Or years or decades of just trying to figure out what the fuck we're doing with our lives. That Mike's, sounds like if WKRP in Cincinnati no, went off the sounds, rails. It sounds like a guy who has uh, been <laughs> drinking since uh, Super Bowl. Uh, oh, today was not honestly going to be my day to be like, I'm going to get my shit together. I'm not going to drink until like 10 and <laughs> go get some, go, I'll, go get, I'll go get some coffee. I'll go... Get some, some that of was my yesterday. Done. I thought I knew that's true. Tracy did bring me some good coffee. That was my yesterday. We, call, we called you in here hours ago with pillow marks still on your head, <laughs> and those pillow marks are gone. I literally have not spoken to a person that quickly within waking up in so long. Um, yeah, that was yeah, that was pretty intense for a minute. But that was, I, but yeah, today was like, I'm going to get, I'm going to get some shit. Cause like, I, it was like Saturday, finished something that I needed to finish Sunday, drink yesterday, drink. And then what's today? 
I did. I, another day. Tuesday. I saw it day right, after. I'm not doing too bad, but I'm like, hey, Fuck, this is I'm my. Full. I got a stream. You know, balance my life out today, and that. Yeah, it's. I, uh, it, yeah, it's. I don't know when it's gonna happen. O Max Cryo Freeze. O Max. It's like IMAX with a O. This is CBD stuff. If you're living with chronic pain, it's like more than just a feeling of discomfort. It can affect your entire life. I know these people, but I also know people that have used this product since it was sent to us ahead of time and it's worked for. What's your story, Chaley? Well, you know, Doug, lifting all that merch in and out of the van all day, it can take its toll. And I get this little pain on the outside of my elbows. And I use that Cryomax roll-on, and that's what you smell when we're driving to the next gig. It's like a mentholatum kind of smell, you know? And that tells me it's working and that I remembered to put it on because sooner or later, that pain just melts away. And I love using it nightly right before I go to bed. And I just dream and dream of lifting big bags of merch over my head and throwing them on stage because I feel totally revitalized by morning. All right, Omax Health is offering my listeners 20% off a full bottle of Cryo Freeze CBD pain relief roll on, plus free shipping. This discount also applies towards any product site wide. Just go to omaxhealth.com and enter Stanhope. That's Omax, O M A X, health.com and enter Stanhope to get 20% off Cryo Freeze and site wide. Yeah. I have so much shit to do. What do you what's on your like to do? Well, I have to re <laughs> <laughs> I have to do a- I have to I have to uh, uh do uh rewrites of the book. <laughs> Wait, what's funny? Sorry. You looking at Doug and saying what's on your to do list. That's funny. Yeah. Oh thanks. Uh okay, so you gotta rewrite the book. Yeah. Okay. I have to have my fucking <laughs> act together to go back on the road. That's true. How much but time I'm, do you spend on that? Like, before you go out on the road, what's your, like, do you sit with it? Like a day before. Because <laughs> otherwise I'll forget. He'll That's fair. Two weeks before. It's yeah. Fair. Figure so, out what uh, suits. Oh, shit. Should I do this, Trace? Yeah. So, uh, last year. This is a sideways career, but listen to it. I was driving back from uh, Boise, and uh, got a call from my brother, my twin brother. My brother-in-law shot himself in the head in front of my sister. And that was the message I got, pulling into Vegas, (laughs) where I was going to get a steak dinner. What, 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 Vegas, like New Year's? Like, no, like in August, coming back from Boise. You not with me? Uh, uh, My brother in law shot himself in the head. Are we doing a Shaley walkout and a Shaley cry podcast? All no, the- thought- no, he's going <laughs> to smash more chairs. I'll stop. No, no, I'm go, done. go, go. No, fuck you. I just wanted to do something. He didn't know where it was coming from, babe. Continue. I said, go. can I do this? Yeah. I said, yes, I haven't I talked about go. this, and it's it's been a while. Sure. And uh, I'm not close with, with my sister, but I texted her immediately because my brother said, this just fucking happened. He shot himself in front of our sister. He walked out and shot himself in in her face, in his face, in front of her. Yeah, yeah her sorry, face, yes. in her face, in his face. Sorry. <laughs> and I, I don't know. I, I fuck. I don't. What do you? We all have. Listen, I know my crowd here, but. Out, outward, I, what do you do on that, right? So I sent her a text that said, this is your brother, Greg? Because I had to differentiate 
between me and my brother because we're twins. I don't know why. But I wanted to make it non-specific. I wanted to make it specific. Uh, not sure what's going on, but I'm here to, if you need to talk. And this is when everything went down. She goes, thank you. I'll call you in a bit. That was August of 2019. Uh, yesterday, <laughs> first contact since. Funny story. <laughs> Sitting here with my friend and she puts on your podcast and she says she's listened to it every week. Cool, huh? First contact from the sister. First contact since... Sister-in-law? Her, the guy I went Sister. to junior high school with. Oh, brother-in-law. Sorry. Bro, my, yeah. And I go, Tracy, how do I answer this? My answer was, yeah, cool. <laughs> what are you, you going to do, right? It's been so much time. There's been no contact. And then she says, I told her that you're my brother, and she's about that shit, LOL. <laughs> There's there's been a funeral There's been shit (laughs) And now she tells me about my Niece My niece is getting married Are you fucking kidding What the fuck I I know all of us have Different things on that I'm so confused On that Why there's nothing, right? Why am I looking I'm at Chad you. for, for I'm empathy? I'm I'm with you. I was I'm looking at Olivia. I'm like, just say something. Olivia, didn't you have some fucking weird story about this last night? Yeah, maybe. What do you remember? Like, no, about, I, uh, I. Like what? Like about like getting a text out of the blue from suicide or fucking people that weird family people that. Ah, uh, I don't know. Nah. But listen. Thanks. I've wanted to talk about this so much because it is that's a like our podcast is that thing where we can talk about those kind of things. And there's been no thrive. There's been nothing. There's been. And then this a fucking (laughs) funny bit. Like it's like so you know what I mean? There's like nothing like there's no gore. There's no like the the deep dark thing of like someone's killing themselves there's no like i need to talk to you there's like oh well by the by someone <laughs> listens to your podcast and said you're one of the guys she listens to there's nothing there did it come up in your phone with the old text nothing. of what you found out yeah. and no then- At, no, yeah. no the last one was me saying hey i uh what's going on uh i'm here I'm your brother. Yeah, and the next What's one up? is next hey, one is like oh, so weird. I was at a coffee lounge and all of a sudden someone said the dog's dead. Or maybe the issues with Andy podcast. Either I was one. Gonna, yeah, what podcast? Which one? <laughs> that that would be funny, but I didn't want to go funny. I wanted to go yeah. supportive. So yeah, yeah. That's the only oh. thing she's ever said. It sucks. That's <sighs> I got That's I got cool. so That's weird cool. at one point. Uh, the only person I've ever admitted that that whole thing happened was to uh, backdoor, and I have no idea why. He says something. Oh, it's because uh, the person that we all know uh, shot himself, and then I thought I had to say something that was on level, so I admitted about my brother-in-law killing himself because I was I'm on the spot. I was I was on the weird side. Did of, you know your brother-in-law? Yeah, since For junior high. Yeah. Yeah. We'll leave it at that. I, 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 extended I family is something that's weird to me. It's not extended. I knew exactly who he was. Yeah, but I'm saying for me. But so you knew that person, like? Oh, I knew him before he was part of the family. <laughs> which I don't is, fucking know those yeah. people. Right. In fact, I knew him so much. That uh, I knew his mom and his stepdad. They were so fucking awesome. And I didn't understand. I know that person. The, uh, <laughs> I didn't understand. It's, the, the, the thing is, 
Uh, fuck. Hey, Tracy, give me another screen. I'm going to break one. <laughs> we understand our collective like circle, right? And then you Written understand. extensively in the book. <laughs> and you like the people. You like pick and choose those people, right? And Family. Then you go, and then you go outside that circle to another circle. And you go like, oh, I like that person. I don't like that person. I like that. I, and there's a lot more likes. There's a lot more dislikes than likes. These people were like the like likes. Like the like I want I want to I, I want to get you in a corner, bro, and talk to you. And this was You're talking about mom and Oh Sarah. my god, they were so interesting. He was a helicopter pilot during the Rodney King incident, and he was taking the, the chief of police out of LA in a helicopter and like doing he was so fucking interesting and the only thing his son-in-law could do is talk over him at every barbecue Ooh. and i'm like oh my god i just want this guy to talk i just want him to keep telling the stories and you don't get that it's like uh ron and gay yeah. you get them alone and you're like just fucking expound keep mm -hmm. going keep going and this, that's that's family uh, I, I'm I, I'm gonna uh, say this quickly. Do not not put this podcast out because you're gonna think, oh, I was drunk uh, and I said shit. But this is stuff that matters to our listeners, people that reach out to us. He's making me the bad guy right now. No, no, I put no. Everything out. No, no. I've, I've not put two <laughs> things out. Oh, Manson. And the Tom Dustin. No, he's not making I, me the bad We don't guy. listen to the Jimmy podcast. Listen, I'm guys. Taking, I'm not that fragile. I'm saying, Relax. No, I'm saying you're the one who edits the this down. and puts it out. <laughs> and don't take this out because this is the shit that matters to fucking listeners where like, oh, wait, this is fucking heartfelt yeah. shit. So please don't take this out because it was Listen, you. a lot of people don't have their friends who get really drunk and then just espouse shit all over them. And they need that in their lives. And we provide that service where we just get really drunk and espouse our shit all over them. I Thank try you, Chad, for, uh, for telling us that. I, I, I try to do that for <laughs> both of you when I get emails like, Hey, this mattered a lot to me because of whatever. And I try to remember to forward those emails to you two. You three, sorry. <laughs> uh, we're all forgetting Olivia Grace is here. You know, it's all right, guys. You guys are having a, this is a, this is, this is you guys' thing. This is a oh, moment. Do you want moment. Olivia's mic on? I could all, <laughs> I'll plot it up. I, I didn't know. She I keeps know talking too much. It's why we hate her. <laughs> <laughs> Doug, I, I, I would be remiss if I didn't say, stop the fucking, like, put, please put this out. I put everything out. There's very few things that don't go out. None of us listen to this because we all hate ourselves, and you probably do too, but you have to listen. I have to. Yeah, but please put, uh, you know, when it gets fucking dark and weird, make sure you put that up because that's what our fucking dark <laughs> listeners in their fucking darkest times. I'm going to take a sip of my uh, wonderfully crafted Bloody Mary cocktail. Yeah, I didn't get I'm a cocktail. Say, hey, Doug, do you think I pick the one podcast that I would like trash to bring out the only time I've talked to my sister <laughs> in a couple of years? You don't think I would like I want this. I, if it was me or Chad, I'll leave Olivia out of this because I don't know what she would do. But Chad and I would definitely go, oh, I was emotional. I'm going to get rid of this. Fuck this. I, I sound like a dildo, but you don't. You sound like fucking So, Shaley, who, you sound like a dildo. Put no. it out. <laughs> you no. don't. You definitely don't. No, don't we would think care. that. He's, he's you saying, think I have some kind of fucking, <laughs> like, where I have some fucking kind of, like, Barometer where I want to go, like, oh, this will make me feel like an idiot. I've been on tour with you, Doug. I've done plenty of things to make you look like an idiot. I'm not worried about this. Do you ever have moments, though, where you're like, oh, shit, shouldn't have said that? I, I, all the time. Really? Still goes out. Okay. Never edited. Respectable. Good work. Absolutely. Yeah. 
Listen, th- I, thanks for not making us listen to this podcast. No, seriously, dude, actually, you guys checking. don't have to because I listen to it with a critical ear to where, like, even when like Doug stammers on something, I'm like, he would get mad if I took out the stammer because Doug wants it to sound real, and that is literally what I do when I edit something from the podcast. It's because. Your stupid fucking six year thing of like, you have 24 hours to regret what you said, which we yeah, don't yeah, do yeah, anymore. We, we stopped. Doing and that. It's, <laughs> that is the number one thing that helped me edit these things quicker. And the and Patreon, I don't have to add a of, shit. Of all my years and of all the dumb shit that I've said, I have only one time ever, yeah. only recently asked Shaylee to just remove something and he did it and it was not even an issue. And you know what? You were 100% right yeah. in that I probably would have done it anyway yeah. because what you said wasn't A, funny yes, or too relevant yes. to what we were talking about. Yeah. And what you said was something that... No one would notice. No. I thought you were going to say it. I did <laughs> too. I was like, oh, oh, I successfully solicited Shelly to edit some out and he says it? Yeah. yeah no, I, I, but, I but, was right to get it edited out. And, I, and I, you only and, get a couple of those, bro, by the way. And I've, yeah, I've bro. of all the years we've been doing this, one absolutely, time I've ever asked. Absolutely. And, I, and you and were 100% you, right. And you agree you I was right. right. Yeah. Because he's an asshole. And he doesn't. He doesn't need to be beat up on. He doesn't need to be beat up on. Guy. I'm telling you, he's an asshole. Doesn't need, doesn't need any more ammunition. And that is the thing: is that there's no editing that's going on unless it's egregious, clearly, or it makes sense. And or when you do sponsors. fucking four podcasts in a row, it is. <laughs> Almost six o'clock. Almost six p.m. Oh my yeah, imagine god! Podcasting wow. For like imagine you stay hours. drunk so long that you start to get a hangover. Oh, oh I, I did. Th- I did that last night. I was on my third drunk, and I was getting the booze shakes while I was drunk. Well, keep getting them now because we're only at thirty minutes. So. Well, we don't even know what number podcast we're on. We. Why do you need to know a number? It's evergreen. I don't know. I keep sniffing I, into the mic. I'm so sorry. It's, it's the I like, keep every tweets time, about it. Every well, time I catch the live tweeting, it, the fact that you're I go, in God, the mic. I hope Greg Chaley cuts this out. I don't. I don't. Nope. No, you only no, get you so many of those. No, you don't. But that's weird. So you really do. You do have things you've said on here that you're like, oh boy. Oh, I, I cringe because uh, yeah. I, I know I'm the only one that listens to it, and I'm listening to it four times to go. Oh, do I need to get rid of it? Do I need to? And I just right. don't. Because someone had to listen to the worst podcasts ever doing due diligence for this book. And Daytona, <laughs> where we did 16 <laughs> podcasts. Oh, the 10-minute podcast. Yeah, 10-minute podcast. Some of them lasted 40 minutes. Yeah. My favorite was and I just kept Chad saying came downstairs the same and said, thing. I think the room's on fire. <laughs> Oh my god. Cuz you you and the manager were smoking so but much. That's not on a podcast. I was hoping to find that on that's, a podcast. Did you say it? No, uh, no, he uh, said that at the bar downstairs. But uh, the podcast girl, we did right before that. Girl, that girl I was going to save her life. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That, never heard that, back from. That's never on a podcast. All I'm doing is repeating the exact same story shit-faced. It was terrible. Well, that's a way to promote it. But anyway. Yeah. So yeah, I've had to listen to the podcast you had to listen to, and I, 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 I sympathize with the fact that you had to put those out. Where I go, I'm a fucking awful person. To be fair, <laughs> I think we got better, <laughs> but not that weekend. <laughs> uh, I believe there was cocaine involved in Florida. They're better. Part that's of the problem. Not, not enough. I, and sushi. <laughs> that's Cocaine the sushi. only thing that I pulled out of that. You guys were way more fucked up because you guys were doing fucking, not uh, maybe you, but Rouse and Andy were oh, doing yeah. heroin and fucking. No, no. This that was on the road hey, before on, they got on, to no, it. It's already on a podcast No, we were doing out. heroin no, a different no, time. after it. That was on no, the road before. before. It. it was, was before. On, before on their way down, yeah. Junior Stopka was the voice of reason and the, the adult driver in, in a fucking like 1994 Ford Tempo 
that he just bought from a fucking guy at the bar and he's driving in Chicago. Them. Yeah. He from drove a Chicago. car from Chicago to Fort Lauderdale to drive them on the tour from Fort Lauderdale oh my. to Chicago. Yeah. I, I put the best of that. I, like I, I it was a, a complete blackout for that whole time. Chaley left me a note that I needed <laughs> When I woke up, because I don't remember the flight out there from Tucson to Daytona, and he wrote, you're in room 621, you're in Do Daytona Beach, and he left me a bag of fucking gummy <laughs> gummy candy. And I, I woke up, and I didn't know where I was, and I read the note, you're in Daytona Beach, you're in room 621. <laughs> and I needed that, because I really didn't know where I was. We knew that because we intercepted you when you got there. Well, the main thing is like you would get up in the morning and probably go to breakfast and not even look at anything and not know where you're at. <laughs> that was the thing. As some fucking weird yeah. waitress and I'm going to save her life. And Oh, my I, God. That fucking. Yep. Oh. And then the manager is smoking. That's not. We're taking the podcast. service elevator down because mm -hmm. it was less of a wait. Because remember, there was only one elevator. Mm -hmm. And taking all these New Yorkers up and down to all these, and then someone said, "No, take the the, the waitress says, take the service." <laughs> yeah, I I, I think she, I think she might have been using me. <laughs> anyway, yeah. it was uh it was it, it was a, it was a good run that none of us remember, but I did did listen to all sixteen podcasts. Oof. Unlistenable. I, I put bad. that in the book. Oh, come Do on. Do not listen to any I of these. I feel bad for you. But everyone else was doing so many more drugs than me. I did a little bit of blow and uh, a microdose. I forgot uh, oh, our friend from, uh, I'll not mention his name, but our the, the, the Burning Man guy. Yeah. No. No. Yeah. No, he was holding yeah, our money. We've, we've, he was he gave me the microdose. So I did a little oh, bit shit. of microdose acid and some blow, but other people were getting into fist fights and shit outside of fucking open mics that I don't remember doing and us ditching people. And I only know that from the podcasts we did where I just kept saying the same stories over well, and over. We were doing 10-minute so podcasts. I hated myself. We were doing, uh, I think we did... 15 podcasts. 16. 16? Yeah, I listen to all of them. Yeah. They're fucking awful. Ooh. Why were you guys, why, why so short? Well, we were trying to do them constantly. We were there for three throughout days. The whole time and, we were there. Oh, yeah. okay. So you it's were like just a, like, like doing gorilla. Little, yeah, yeah. Little, Sean like, Rouse shows up. Let's do it. Okay. And by the way, they were very, they were very good. Don't listen to him. No, they're fucking terrible. They're good. Listen to them all. I listened to them. It was embarrassing. Me. Because you're listening to you. Completely. Yeah. Uh, you're not I, listening to what you're saying. But I, I listen to I you. Everyone. I know I you was would. I the same story over and over again. Ugh. I wouldn't know because I haven't listened to those, but I do know that like there's been podcasts that we've done that have gone out that I was like, I feel pretty good about how that went. And then I'll listen to like five seconds of me talking and then be yeah. like, oh, because well, yep, you're listening yep. to you. Uh, you not, listen to the yeah. podcast. You yeah. on, I've done it. Tw I've done it twice. I did it, it once on accident where it, oh. it ended up playing for some reason. It was like you had just tweeted it and it like clicked onto just oh. my laugh. All these like years. Like, just the timing of it, and all, it was like, All these oh. years, and I do not oh, listen God. to the podcast. So, so yeah. get better at what you do. I've That's exactly to... what I was saying. There's been times oh, where I've so listened to... Uh, it, I listened to it on purpose to be like, okay, well, how do I really come off on this? And then that was just like, oh, God, I really... But that's that goes back to you taking things out, though. Is It's like... I would... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not, the, the, the point was not me taking things out. No. It was me not taking a lot of things out. That was my point. That's not what you said. Yeah, it's like it goes. It goes back to you taking things out. It's like I, I've, I've said things on the podcast that I've been like, oh shit, like, ugh, that didn't sound great. But I would never go like take this out because it's too. It's like oh, you wouldn't be just, a pussy like Chad. Well, I should just be. Well, one, I should just be like, I'll just be better at it next time. And also, yeah. like, if it was bad enough, you would anyways. Yeah. <laughs> I wish we so, didn't fight. Someone, someone, someone tweeted me. Like, hey, uh, uh, why don't you slap Joe Rogan around <laughs> when I was? And I, I want when, when he just called you a pussy. 
I, I, oh, that wasn't you. It was Rogan. But yeah. same rules apply. Uh, why don't you slap Joe Rogan around and get him on board with this fucking Andrew Yang? Thing? Uh. Yeah, really? I'll slap Joe Rogan around? That's like saying slap fucking Chad Shank around. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta, yeah. I mean, like entertainment is a fucking. Uh, it, it feels like the wild west as far as what w- this is, or entertainment and shit. But everything uh, else, and everything else, feels like the wild west too. Getting toilet paper, uh, driving it, you know, yeah. it feels like, uh, and it feels like it's gonna break uh, weirder too. So it's like, uh, yeah, the more we do this, it probably. You know. I look at these pictures of all these empty shelves, and I tell you, having all these bullets makes me feel very comfortable. Yeah, <laughs> that's a true that's thing. It. That's a true fucking statement. I like it. it yeah, I don't I, even. Mind. I feel like that antique gun that's missing the uh, middle piece is not as good of a bluff as it was a week ago. <laughs> I felt like, like some tough talk and waving that gun around. <laughs> you all have it in a bag. <laughs> Wear a member's only jacket and keep it in the pocket. <laughs> hey, everybody. It's me, Brett Erickson, from the Issues with Andy podcast. Uh, we love you, Killer Termites, and we hope you'll tune in and uh, check us every Friday. Issues with Andy on uh, YouTube. Uh, yeah, look, it's it's a it's not a podcast, right? Isn't it a vod vodcast? You're right. For once, Andy, you're right. It's a vodcast, <laughs> which means uh-huh. it's a podcast it. fueled by vodka. <laughs> If you love the shit you're getting here on the Doug Stanhope podcast, you get more shit with us on Issues with Andy on YouTube every Friday. And yeah, we'll, you keep listening and watching or however you do it, and we'll keep shitting. Chad, I don't... How are you? What? I said, uh, Chad, how are you? I'm drunk. Okay. I'm incredibly I drunk. I have nothing to con- I have me. nothing to contribute <laughs> whatsoever. Listen, she's done Other very than- good work, Tracy. Yeah. We did this many podcasts in a row and we're still talking. Because we've done single podcasts where I'm sober to shit faced in an hour because she overserves. So she's done well. We we uh Oh, she's back in the room. Sorry, we can talk about nothing. Her. We can not talk about her behind about her back, in front of her face. No, I've, I've I said how much she overserves, and she's she's like no way emphatic on like I'm serving you one shot, but she's not. She's she's free pouring. And no, I'm not. We don't want that. We want we want the Tracy bar. She just overserved you with a can of a can of beer, and, and I think she there's. I think put she put a four shot in shots there. of fucking vodka in it. We don't want a Tracy that is totally rigid and like giving us one, one and a half ounces of liquor. And I was a young man once, and I was totally rigid. Yes. <laughs> Boy, those were the days. Yeah. Those were the days. Oh my God! So much- you do, you do, worthy. Boys were girls and men were men. Now you wake up, you sit down, who for who for again? That's how we get around the copyright thing. See? Uh, you just slur yeah, by fucking up the words uh, and confusing Olivia Grace. All right, Doug. Hey, five more minutes and we can call this one. Wait. We, I don't have five minutes in me. Hey, let's just sit here and wait. No kidding. Let's wait it out quietly. Shh. This no. is a free one. So uh, this is a let's Olivia Grace. Patreon a, and a, get the Olivia real Grace one. wants to. Let's wait it out quietly with with the rest of everybody <laughs> else. Shh. What about Olivia Grace? Five minutes. At Olivia does bits. Hey Olivia, what's your uh, podcast? Huh? Exactly. Olivia's doing oh, huh? a podcast. I started one. I'm put it out yet though what's it gonna be called it's gonna be called olivia has a travel show a little wordy hmm. oh the doug stanhope shot clock podcast is it a mouthful know, of words talking about. oh some fucking about. guy uh emailed me hey i'm just uh catching up on the doug stanhope shot clog podcast yeah. you said you wanted to come back to canada <laughs> wait okay <laughs> you've been back here twice 
<laughs> but 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 shock clog podcast we did for like eight episodes yeah. in 2016. <laughs> uh, yeah, all right, just don't 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 talk bad. Don't say bad things. I I I I've I've been trying to be positive. That's weird. I know that you it's, came to that realization. Yeah, like I, but no, like Not Chad Shank. Sometimes you wake up and you want to yell at people. And uh, I, I've, 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 I've been good about not doing that. And I, I've been good. Shannon, you remember Shannon? <laughs> yeah. We're like, oh, hey, we're, we do actually make a difference in people's lives. That's why you can't edit out your fucking actual pain. Yeah, we go through some shit and people respond to it. And all sorts of fucked up people email us and I try to share that like yeah we're fucking making a difference by sharing all the fucking ugliest parts of ourselves so yeah don't edit it out and two more minutes <laughs> I thought Shannon Chad was you should have just done the stretch like thing like, no, that's actually like non audio. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, I, I thought it'd be funnier if I just I've had, I've had a right number, of, uh, number of references to the uh, the gal who uh, contacted you. And we talked oh, about wait. Yeah, so oh, wait. So have I. Wait, so have I. In that, in that uh, uh, people have said that uh, I should start the uh, sad, fat fucks <laughs> dating app. <laughs> dating oh, app. yeah. Which I have uh, termed, uh, called. Trundle, because <laughs> I think it's a mixture of, of Tumblr, Bumble, yeah, and Bumble, fucking Tinder. Bramble. No, it sounds like a fat person rolling down the hill. Yes. Trundle, trundle. Why, why run into rejection when you can trundle into love? Dude, yeah. oh my yeah, god! You have a, an elevator pitch to a, a dating yeah, app oh based on fucking all sad fucks. Yes. Yeah. It's Nobody wants me. Somebody. Go on Trundle. You get the Nobody wants me either. Let's Software's meet already out there. Dude, you can. Dude, you can. I, uh, uh, Mike already started looking at it. Oh, Mike, will do a, it. Yeah. Prisoner whole... Mike. That's you think so I can great. read that right now? <laughs> trundle. Try it before you die it. <laughs> That's so good. Trundle, the <laughs> penultimate solution. <laughs> uh, for the record, for the record, penultimate so means great. second to last. That is so but fucking do you, great. That's so I, good. I don't know if this was on the Tom Dustin podcast, but Tom Dustin had penultimate means the second to last. Yeah. But the third anti penultimate is what he told us was third to last. Yeah. <laughs> Tracy's already trying to chime in with her fucking knowledge of English, but she's not on a mic ever. No. That's why I am voting for Olivia to be on the Mount Rushmore. Well, and not I'll get Tracy. A, I got a, I got a, no, someone, it should be Tracy. Someone send us a I lavalier so mic. Yeah. Someone sent us a lavalier mic for Tracy, but I just haven't done it because... No, Tracy, you used to put it on her and she... I did, and she doesn't like it. No, so, and she wouldn't talk. I'm like a pony. What? <laughs> You're talking about me like I'm a pony. I well, put that bit in her mouth, and she just didn't like it. She didn't take to it, so we put her... She's pulling the plow. If you can't hear Tracy, it's because she's not wearing the bit in her uh, pony lavalier mouth. That somebody sent <coughs> they sent a good one. It was actually a good one. So, you're just telling them fuck off. No, you put it on me anytime. Put it on me anytime. Got it. So if I don't talk, I don't Come talk. Come anytime. That's the 80s. Uh, we're going to have to listen to some uh, soul music now after I hear Tracy say, put it on me anytime. We got to listen to Marvin Gaye. We, we, oh we, we, we must be I'll at, play Come uh, Anytime. That's an 80s, two, 80s two minutes must be up by now. Yeah, we're at, yeah, we're at you're the out. Point. You're yeah. out. All right, we'll talk to you from wherever I am next. Where, uh, wait, where are you going next? Uh, where do you go? This is, like, com. this is poor, uh, this is a uh, 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 you're gonna be in fucking. Uh, I'm drunk. Just say something about bingo. 
Bingo left. No. <laughs> Gonna yeah. Have her do this. Out. Have her do that. Oh, hey, bingo. Take us out of here. Okay. Bye bye now. How does it work for anal?